die. Before we answer this question, we need to know about anatomy. Both of our eyes have eyelashes arranged in two to three rows anteriorly along the eyelid margins. Each eyelash follicle is associated with oil secreting glands called glands of Zeiss. Another oil secreting glands called meibomian glands are also present in the dense connective tissue plates, also known as tarsal plates, which also provide skeletal support and are placed posteriorly in the eyelid. External hordeolum or sty. Hordeolum, that is Latin for barley, a type of cereal grain, is a medical term used for a swelling in the eyelid resembling a grain of barley. Sty or external hordeolum is an acute infection, usually from staphylococcal bacteria, of the lash follicle and the associated glands of Zeiss. Same infection occurring in meibomian glands is called internal hordeolum. Signs and symptoms. Patient will present with a tender swelling in the lid margin, swelling pointing anteriorly through the skin with a lash at its apex, redness and edema may also be present. It can also appear as multiple lesions as infection can spread from one lash follicle to the next. It can also lead to preceptal cellulitis. Treatment. It may occasionally resolve by itself. The eyelash should be plucked to promote drainage if the pus point is present. Hot compresses should be done to localize the infection, pus point, and also for patient comfort. Oral antibiotics may be given, especially in diabetic patients and recurrent cases, as oral antibiotics reach the internal eyelid structures more easily than eye drops. Topical antibiotic ointment should be applied to prevent adjacent infection. Treat associated blepharitis if present. Incision and drainage may be required in severe cases.